Good morning. We are on our zero day, walking towards Walmart so that we can pick up the bus to take us to the downtown so that we can do our laundry. <laughs> because the, the hotels around here don't have washer and dryer, so we've got to go all the way downtown. Who knows how long this is going to take. The bus is going to be here in like 11 minutes. There's been uh, tornado warnings all over the area. The rain has subsided for a little bit and it's gonna rain again. We are definitely happy that we made the call and got off the mountains. Everyone there is probably soaked. Hopefully people got down. All right, I'll check in with you later. We located the bus stop. Now we need to just wait on the bus. We are at Laundry Land and just now starting our wash. We are the only ones in here. We just finished our laundry and now we are headed to the outfitter look what decided to come out the sun down here so we're happy to get a reprieve from that rain but i am destined to always go uphill uh, we're in town and now i'm hiking up a hill <laughs> uh, so i think the outfitter's on this next street And we'll be there. Boy, there's a lot of good smells down here. Seriously. <laughs> so we're waiting on the, uh, the transit to go back to the hotel and we have about 40 minutes and we thought we'd go ahead and uh, share or answer some more viewer uh, questions. And right after we did our last Q&A, I thought of two things that I totally forgot. And one is what we're wearing right now. Uh, these are uh, OR Sun hoodies. That is one of our gear changes. So when I sent home my fleece, this is what I am using to replace it. Uh, the only thing is, I feel like this, uh, this hoodie is just too thick for me. I can't wear it. I get too hot when I'm hiking. So I've been on the lookout to like, since like a couple days after I bought it, I've been on the lookout for a lighter weight hoodie, but we just haven't been able to, to locate one. So I'm, uh, we're using it when it's cooler out and uh, I'm mm -hmm. using it when it's cooler out. What about you? Well, the men's uh, version is a, is a lot thinner material and breathes yeah. a lot better. Yeah, how, how fair is that? And so we have the exact- I'm satisfied with mine. We have the exact same uh, model of OR hoodie and the men's is lighter. I wish mine was. I don't know, I guess females tend to be colder, but I I really want a lighter material. It's just too thick. Mm -hmm. would be that. Another gear change that I thought of was, uh, and I'll show you here, is my fanny pack. So I, um, it's actually the same exact fanny pack I had. Uh, mine, my zipper was broken in one direction. I've had this fanny for years, uh, the fanny for years, and I abused it. I overstuffed it. I, um, yeah, I abused it. And it's, it's definitely, I've got my money's worth. And so I uh, had it shipped to my daughter's house and it came in. That was one of the things we were waiting on too when we were back in Parisburg. And <laughs> The funny thing is, is I feel like Light AF has heard me. I had been complaining about how small the darn thing was for years, and uh, they made it a little bigger, and it's perfect. So Light AF, thank you for making this fanny uh, a little bigger because it's. I have to carry an EpiPen, I have to carry an inhaler, and um, all the other stuff I like to carry. So I'm. I'm so happy that it's bigger. It's perfect now. It's a perfect size. 
the first question we'll answer is um, they said there hasn't been a lot of ticks and bees lately is it because of the cold and the rain and as a matter of fact a couple days ago Maytag pulled a tick off me mm -hmm. I I was like is, I just showed him it was at the bottom of my leg and I said is this a, is that a tick and he looked he goes sure enough uh, but the tick wasn't really attached. It what it wasn't he's saying it wasn't really attached so mm -hmm. uh, I know it was starting to attach because I tried to flick it off and it wouldn't go off so I knew it, it was start starting to, to dig in mm -hmm. but uh, no worries uh, we both are carrying uh, dox, doxycycline mm -hmm. Doxy. doxycycline and uh, that's an antibiotic and if you take it within the first 72 hours 72 hours uh, two pills according to his doctor, mm -hmm. then uh, you should be safe. So we have we both have that, mm -hmm. which is good. And there are bees everywhere. Yeah, there are bees everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. I mean, uh, the only day we didn't have bees a lot was the day we hiked a couple days ago in the rain all day. Uh, but then once the rain started lightening up, the bees started coming out. And then we're talking big bumblebees everywhere, mm -hmm. everywhere. Another question or comment was, uh, you like Coke Zero, what does Maytag like to drink? Fresca, of course. Fresca. It's hard to find around here though. Yeah, we don't get to see much Fresca. No. However, he does like Coke Zero as well, yeah, but he, he likes Fresca better. Mm -hmm. Thanks for asking. Well, that about wraps it up. Uh, we gotta get a ride, get back to the hotel. Uh, pack up and get ready for tomorrow. We hope you have a great evening. Bye-bye.